I'm Max Horseman. I'm a principal consultant here at Trident Search, and I'm joined today by Ankita Gupta, CEO and co-founder at Acto.io. Please have you on board, Ankita. How are you today? Hi, Max. Very nice to meet you, too. Um, I am doing very well. Uh, just woke up. Um, very good morning. Uh, it's Sunday that uh, we are taking this, uh, we, we are recording this video on, so it's it's a great day. Yeah, absolutely. And appreciate that. Um, and thanks for coming on board. So, look, I think the, the right place to start would be um, for you to introduce Acto.io for those in the audience that aren't familiar with you guys. Yeah, yeah, Max. Uh, so Acto is an API security platform. Uh, we have been in this space for three years. I'm the co-founder and CEO of Acto. Um, and uh, yeah, so uh, we sell to application security leaders uh, by API security. What I mean is um, imagine users getting using Acto, they get visibility into uh, all of their APIs. Uh, they know what what APIs they have, um, what is the what is the posture security posture of those APIs, uh, what vulnerabilities are there in those APIs, are there any attacks happening? All of those kind of information uh, you get uh, when you install Acto. Um, and uh, yeah, that's that's about Acto. Our team is global. Uh, we have about uh, we are an early stage startup, startup, so it's like 20, 25 people all across the globe. Um, I'm based in SF, so yeah. Lovely. And can you talk to us about your journey so far? Appreciate you've not been founded that long, but I'm really keen to know the kind of journey and also what your plans are for the future. Yeah. So. Um... The journey has been, uh, as, as I said, we started three years ago, and uh, uh, so me, so in total, like both me and my uh, co-founder, we we've had like good 13, 14 years of experience, and uh, in our mid 30s, and uh, you know, like we we met each other six years back in uh, in our previous company. Uh, we we were colleagues. Um, he was VP engineer. I was more handling the business side of things. And um, we found this problem uh, in a previous company. That's when we started, you know, searching for okay, if, if if there's a vendor that's solving for it, if there's um, if there is a solution that exists, because that is something that we couldn't solve very, uh, uh, you know, in a very automated way uh, in a previous company. So uh, we left our company. We started, you know, looking for. Uh, uh, looking to understand more about the market, looking to understand more about the users' problem, and we um, there was I think a few months uh, down the line, and we realized we had some unique insight about the market, um, and uh, and that really became our roadmap. It was uh, pretty incredible. So uh, six months we didn't really uh, build a platform or anything. We just talked. We just talked to users, and then uh, we built the platform. Uh, for six months uh, re released an MVP and. And yeah, uh, got a bunch of customers and uh, got funding. Uh, of course, uh, needed funding funding uh, to hire more people and all of that. Um, and uh, yeah, and I think last this year, actually last year, we open sourced the product, and that was a phenom phenomenal journey. And I think that really, really helped us uh, with our GTM, with leads, with uh, getting users to try out our product uh, and all of that. And this year has been really like it's really pushed us take us uh, far into you know like really getting enterprise users enterprise customers uh, to use the product so it's been um, it's been an incredible 3 years every 6 months it feels like oh we've crossed some milestone so uh, it is amazing it's been amazing i love that so like product led growth then uh, i would say it's a, it's both product led plus sales most of our uh, leads are actually inbound uh, but in terms of closing it, it's more it's more we closing, uh, uh, you know, the the deal, like the sales. It has to touch us before it closes. Awesome. So, yeah. And are you targeting enterprise? It's uh, yeah, it's very much it's a uh, little bit mid market, but mostly uh, large organizations, enterprises. Awesome. And obviously, the reason we're here is the build up to Black Hat, right? So, can you talk to uh, the audience about kind of your plans for Black Hat. It'd be really good to understand that. Yeah, so uh, plans for Black Hat is um, uh, it's 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 awesome actually. So last year we didn't have uh, any booth. We were there, but we were speaking. 
uh, right me and my co-founder we um, we had we were there for the entire we we spoke in a lot of sessions but this year the uh, the beginning of the year uh, we uh, me my marketing team we sat down and we said okay what all events we have to cover and black hat was obviously one of those black hat we, uh, besides vegan in fact we wanted to have uh, you know presence in defcon as well but defcon didn't allow really booth so uh, we now have a we now we now have an activity in AppSec Village, but um, but we have a startup booth event in Black Hat. We have a startup booth, and it's um, it's something that we are very very excited about. Like the whole team is looking at you know how what stacks sw swags to get, what booth panels to get, you know the colors and the whole customer experience, and that if somebody comes to the booth, like how do you treat them? Like all of that journey is now it's uh, now being uh, you know thought about and executed um uh by the team and uh india there's this besides vegas is actually also very important to us uh because a lot of our customer base comes uh from besides kind of events um uh, it, it's it's an amazing event as well uh so we have a booth there and um and apart from that just that whole week is crazy you know like uh, defcon brings a lot of like hacker kind of crowd and blackhead brings a lot of CISO kind of crowd and besides vegas brings all like Cloud security, AppSec, all of those kind of clouds. So it's it's really all the people coming together in Vegas to celebrate cybersecurity, and I think that's um, that's a great opportunity for any founder, uh, any cybersecurity founder, because um, for me it's personally like meeting all of those people, the CISOs, the application security heads, the the users who use Acto, but we haven't really met them in person, right? Like. Uh, uh, as I told you, we have an open source community, and they, they, there's like so many people who are using from different parts of the world. So um, those people have told me that they are going to be coming and they want to meet us and all that. So, um, so yeah, so it's uh, it's uh, I'm super excited about it. It's it's in four weeks, and uh, my team is working very hard right now to make that happen. You know, like like all the social media, all the excitement before it, all the all the getting the swags together and everything so yeah absolutely i can only imagine and it sounds like it's going to be a productive event uh, what i took away from that is that you're going to be here there and everywhere everywhere black hat um but yeah we'll put a link in into this video so that if anyone wants to follow you um directly and and i'm sure your marketing team will be posting more details so they can they can follow that um well look, i obviously really appreciate your time today ankita i'm excited to meet you in august um and yeah thanks for joining